Hello, welcome to Brickwright. This is the last video in the Titanic project. We've now complete Brad Army, so yeah. we are done. So we're willing to show you our work. Hopefully you like it. This is the uh, the Marshall's Vesuro patio in the um, in the cream that we laid uh, with the Marshall's jointing compound, the, the charcoal medge. So I'll get out your way. That's that. If you come close, Brad, just want to show them. Have a little look at this slab. Get a close in on that one. And then just to show you, you, you get a, a close in on this one. And now this one. And you can see now, move back a little bit further on this one. You can see the diversity of what the what the paving actually gives you because this one, look, is completely plain. And that is the beauty of Indian sandstone because it's a natural product you get in the variation in colour. So what we'll do now, you've seen this bit, we'll swing round and we'll show you the next bit. On this section we brought through this as a wrap around, so show them where we were Brad. That's up there where we were. This section now has come through, we've incorporated flower beds this side, flower beds that side. If you've watched the videos, if you haven't, go back. We've got soakaways in there and in there. Patio comes through here. So you've got a planting system going in there that the client wants to do. Likewise in here, so if you follow me down Brad, this is the rest of the patio. So that's the Marshalls Vesuro patio complete. And we'll move on now to show you the uh, the drive seas, uh, on the, uh, the drive seas paving system. If you come really close Brad, I'll show you what it looks like closer. So if you remember, on the playlist, we put this driveway system in, we built up the levels, we put path edgings in, and all the path edgings, all the way around, you can't see, they're invisible, because the client didn't want to see any pin curb. So they're below ground, but still serving a purpose. So this is the drive sys paving, the Brad will, uh, will show you, all jointed in the Marshall's uh, special compound. So there we go, there's a close up of that one. So that's that. So we'll move on and we'll show you another drive. So this is a separate Marshalls drive sys paving that we did. So this is the incorporation of that one, or continuation rather, of that one. Going right the way up, we've got a recessed manhole cover there that we cut around. And the special little trick that Brad came up with with this one is left to right. So all down the left hand side and all down the right hand side. He challenged us, which was really good not to have any cuts so there's no cuts all the way up there and all the way down there on the left hand side and you had the patience to do it not me yeah and that was a really really good setup so no cuts apart from around the manhole so that's that drive sea system we put drainage in here just as a just as a backup in case the wind wants to blow into the garage and then we could have let all the water go out onto this one but we incorporated the drainage system connected into the main drain with the back inlet gully so there's water in it to not allow any smells to come out. So that's the second drive seas paving system. And we'll show you the driveway with the chip-ins and the decorative stone. The driveway we've put in, in the decorative stone, Brad's showing you now. If you remember, we've put it in the driveway crate system underneath that from Ibram. They went really, really well. Um, so that went in, we got an MOT base underneath and a decorative stone with a weed membrane on top. So there we go, 26 ton in there. And then we edged it. If you come close, Brad, get close up on there. We edged it with a drive sys paving system, which matches the one you've just seen, and that goes as an edging all the way around to the bottom of the drive. Next, we'll show you the grass. The lawn we put in, we put 70 ton of topsoil in here to raise the levels, because it was like that, so we did that. 70 ton, and then we got a premium grass, um, from local, from us local in South Wales, this grass is really, really nice. Really ticks all the boxes, and it just looks lovely, doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. Really pleased with the way it turned out. So I'll get out your way, and Brad can show you all the grass. There we go. So what I'll do now, I'll get on the phone, 
and I'll um, give you a little view of it all in this whole perspective so, so, you, so you can see the whole thing and how it's turned out because we're quite proud of this one mate aren't we yeah, yeah we put a lot of work and effort into this so uh, yeah stay tuned and I'll show you a little bit more detail coming up right now go then hope hopefully you enjoyed the tour any questions leave them in the comments below thank you to brad because he put a hell of an effort in on this so he's behind the camera so brad you know i always appreciate you mate love you to bits mm. thank you very much for all your effort same to fraser same to dayton and uh mr and mrs young has been absolutely fantastic to us mate haven't they they've really yeah. treated us well yeah and they're lovely lovely us. lovely people and they're so pleased with the job and we're so happy to have been able to uh have done what they wanted us to do so there we are i hope you like it any questions leave the comments below other than that please like subscribe and we're on to the next one which is another driveway a smaller one in tobermore this time so stay tuned for the next job see you then cheers <laughs>